What is up guys, Max here, and welcome back to another quick and easy Photoshop tutorial. Now in today's tutorial, we're gonna learn how to create this photo collage inside of Photoshop, a really simple method to make your collages work really well. Now as always, right before we get started, be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell to stay up to date on all the videos. You can also check out the Twitter, Instagram, and Discord channel, all linked down below. And if you like this song you're currently listening to, you can sign up for a 30-day free trial to Epidemic Sound a really simple way to support the channel. Let's get started. Okay, so here we are with a blank document in Photoshop and I wanna make three equal columns. So let's do that really quick. Let's go to View, New Guide Layout. Now with the New Guide Layout, make sure it's set to default. Uh, let's go to Columns, let's do three, and set the gutter to zero. Just like so, and then click OK. Next up, we actually wanna create a shape that fills this section. So let's grab our Shape Tool uh, do the fill, let's make it, I don't know, purple or orange, it doesn't matter too much, and draw out a shape that fits this exactly. Now it doesn't have to be, ex it doesn't have to be exactly perfect, let's turn the stroke off, and then grab our shape tool, hit Command T or Control T on the keyboard to increase the size of this shape to fit this perfectly. Now I'm going to let it bleed over the edge because we just have a, a 3840 by 2160 document and that's okay. Um, but now we have the perfect width we're looking for. Now click the check mark. Now you could line it up on the top and bottom, but for this tutorial purposes, we don't really need that. And let's make sure this shape actually fits the edges over here as well. Just like so. Now what we can do is actually go to our layers over here. Go to Window and Layers if you don't see it. Let's duplicate this rectangle by dragging it down to the plus icon right here. And now double click this little icon right here. Opens up the color. Let's change it to like purple so we can actually move it. Hold, click it, hold shift on your keyboard to move it over. Now uh, let's duplicate the orange one one more time. Uh, click it, hold shift, and move it over. Now we have our three equal pieces. Perfect. Now we can turn our guides off. Let's go to view and then uh, clear guides. Those are turned off and we're good to go. All right, great. Now we want to put images in here. Now down below, there'll be three images I'll be using. You can download those images, just like the beginning of this tutorial, the same ones you saw. Um, if not, you can use your own images. So let's start with this. So let's grab our rectangle one, which is this one over here. Let's go over here and then hit file, place embedded. From here, we can select the photo. Let's select uh, this one right here. Uh, drag it over into place. Now place it in by checking the check mark right here, and then go to Layer, Create Clipping Mask, which will clip it to Rectangle 1. Grab Rectangle 2 or Rectangle 1 Copy 2 right here. Um, this is the orange one on the far right. Let's go to File, Place Embedded, and just repeat the process until we have secured all of our photos inside of all of these images. Hit the check mark, Layer, Create Clipping Mask. Same thing for Rectangle 1, Copy, File, Place Embedded, grab the middle photo. As you can see, we can actually scale this one up a little bit. Hold Alt or Command or Keyboard and scale it up a little bit. Make sure we're above Rectangle 1 right here. And then do Layer, Create Clipping Mask. As you can see, it's perfectly done. What you can do now is actually grab other ones. Let's say we want to move this. Uh, you can scale it up by holding Command T on our keyboard or Control T. Hold Alt or Command to scale it up. And it fits perfectly right there. Now, if you turn the other layers off, you can actually see that these are perfectly on these sides. They're shaped exactly to the shapes. And that is how you create a quick and easy collage inside of Photoshop. As always, guys, I'm Max. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for being a part of the channel. If you are new to the channel, feel free to like and subscribe. Other than that, I guess I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.